How important is your mortgage lender in the home buying process? While finding the right home is obviously of critical importance, your lender is one of the most important people you will work with when buying a home. The lender can save you thousands or cost you thousands. It's important to know the right questions to ask when interviewing the person that is going to have a significant impact on your largest monthly debt. A good lender can help you navigate the complex process of obtaining a mortgage and can save you thousands of dollars in the long run. Experienced real estate agents typically have a lineup of professionals they like to work with, including lenders. While it's easy to take a recommendation from an agent you've grown close to, it's important to remember that it's your money and it's up to you to do your due diligence. Let's discuss three important questions to review with your potential lender before signing on the dotted line. First, is your lender familiar with your specific area and local loan programs? There may be first-time homebuyer programs for your county or state, or special neighborhood mortgage programs offered in your city. Whether it's a national lender or local lender, they should be aware of programs that may benefit you. There are literally thousands of them across the country. Secondly, interest rates. Did you know the difference of even a quarter of a point in an interest rate, for example? Let's use 5.5% versus 5.25% over 30 years, with a $300,000 mortgage loan is more than $70,000. Rates make a difference, a huge difference. They are changing almost every day, and you should keep up on the rates, but also understand the lender's yield spread and what they are charging you compared to other lenders. Lenders are in the business of making money and do deserve a paycheck at the end of a transaction, but you may be able to find that lender taking less of a profit on your behalf and saving you thousands of dollars in the long run on the rate or in the short run on closing costs. There is absolutely nothing wrong with having a transparent discussion with a lender regarding rates and how you are being charged. While it's not imperative that you know the intricacies of exactly how a lender gives you a mortgage quote and how they come up with their pricing, it's good to be informed and have an open dialogue. It will lead to you most likely working with that lender for years to come and a lifetime of referrals from you as well. The third question to ask your lender is regarding your closing fees. This is something that the majority of buyers never think to ask because we often just assume they are fixed and could never be changed, questioned or challenged. Closing fees can range anywhere from two to 6% of the loan. You can borrow a certain percentage of your closing costs depending on the type of mortgage program, but the important question is what fees actually mandatory and what fees are, if any, on your good faith estimate able to be negotiated. Buyers often change the type of mortgage they are participating in, and if so, you should be getting an updated good faith estimate from your lender. When the type of mortgage changes and the terms change, it is very likely that your fees will change as well. It would be great if they went down, but if they go up, then clearly you need to be informed. Nobody likes last-minute surprises. In summary, your mortgage lender can be a tremendous asset in the home buying process. That individual can and should spend time educating you on the process. What to expect, ask questions about your home ownership goals to help you fit into the right type of mortgage and be transparent with you throughout the process. If you have a lender that tells you to just go online and fill out the loan application, that is probably not the best lender for you. There are thousands of very educated lenders out there that will help you in your journey. Look out for your best interests and make the process an easy and enjoyable one for you. If you're not sure what loan programs might work for you, click on our other videos explaining the different loan options out there. The links will be in the description.